Welcome back, everybody, to Farming Simulator 17. Here with your host, not the most, though, Mr. Blue, aka Tommy Miller. Folks, we're on Chanelitan's Farms uh, 17. Uh, probably going to be a short video because uh, our crop's not ready, except for the sugar beets. We got to get them. Um, this is an old uh, Thactron 415, it's a sugar beet harvester. Uh, by Gimme. I can't remember who made it, but start this bad boy up and unfold. I gotta hop out for a second, get my hood up here. And, uh, yeah. Now we'll zoom out. Uh, this thing is insanely. It, it's just not real, folks. It's 62 mile an hour. I don't know how fast it harvests, but it holds one or two million liters so uh let's fire this bad boy up and just get to town uh i am gonna hire out a worker i think uh, let's try that right there no i don't want ai i don't want ai let's just turn that off so i gotta hop out get my display back up there we go um yeah Let's uh, go to town. 24 mile an hour. That's too fast. We're going to slow it down to maybe 14. I can handle that right there. Good lord, that's unreal, folks. But it works. Mr. Yankee's driving this thing. No wonder it's going fast. No, I'm just kidding, folks. If you go down below, uh, and he's down in the description. Uh, a lot of federal, fair, awesome YouTubers. I was trying to say fellow family members. Um, Mr. Yankees helped me out a lot. And quite a few of the other ones down there gave me shout outs and helped me out a lot. To get to my 500. Now, I'm finally kind of staying at. You know, I was like, I hit 500, got excited, posted it up to Facebook, and next day I'm back down to 497. I'm like, what the heck? What the heck? Then I finally got back up 500 again. Everybody's like, congratulations, you know, like, well, I already hit 500. This is my second time. So I actually hit 500 three times. And then I, on the third time, I hit 501. <laughs> and then now I'm down 500 and it's been staying there for about three or four days hopefully I'll shoot on up but anyway you know I, I'm not all about how many subs I got I'm all about how many family members I got y'all are family folks no matter what it's called just remember y'all part of the YouTube family and some of y'all are a little bit more than YouTube family or real life family but Y'all family, you know, just cause it, you're on YouTube, don't mean it's just cause it's YouTube, but, you know, we can be family no matter where we're at, even if we decide to meet in person one day. But, uh, yeah, we're going to let Mr. Yankee do this since he's doing pretty good. Um, ain't got too much there to go. Uh, I don't want to go that way, I want to go this way. Bye. Looking up at the sky there, wouldn't I? Uh, apparently, our crops are 85%. And this is oh, that back, the uh, second day, actually, of uh, we harvested corn yesterday. It would let us. But today, it won't let us harvest our other crops because they ain't quite ready. So, um, fix and hit winter time or fall here pretty quick so um so i'm gonna hit the clock about 15 times um because i'm really trying to get to about 11 o'clock today i'm hoping that would change everything because if not folks look at the rain that's coming in uh these combines here are from farms farm sim steve uh he's 
done pretty good. It, not actually his combine, but he uh, edited it and stuff and put a lot of little twerks and tweets in it. And I love it, folks. Um, I'm using the McDonald 45-foot header. I'm going to try it out. If not, I'm just going to go ahead and get the the other combine down here that has his header. Whoa. Uh, this is a header that goes with it. The 9250 Dana Flex. Uh, awesome little header. Uh, it's 12 meter. And down there is 13.7. So I'm going to try to see if it'll handle it. If so, I'll change this now to a McDonald. Uh, nothing towards Farm Sam, but I just love the McDonald headers when they are working right. Um, you got the, uh, the auger wagon there ready. You got the wind roller ready for the straw. You got the baler ready. And the pickup truck. And I got uh, two uh, trucks down here to handle the grain. And I uh, got, got the fuel trailer down here, by the way. It works without the truck, so that's awesome. Um, just in case you didn't know or heard or anything, I've had trouble with my maps, and that's because of the big M wide mower, and I had to take it out of the system. It was really thrown everywhere. Got these bells here because I'm fixing by some animals. As you can see, my money is going up. Uh, poor Betsy don't have no grass. Um... As shown, it's planted as grass, but it's just not growing right yet. Probably the wrong time of the year. But it's planted, and uh, we're just waiting for it to get it. Now, y'all might say, what the heck happened here? Now, we got our square bells here, folks. Uh, this whole uh, straw right here. Hay and grass. No spot for silage. So, I went ahead and installed this one. Let's see if I can do this right. You gotta hit J on the keyboard and then voila, I can raise myself up without using the mouse now. Um, but yeah, I installed this, uh, got it even with that, so it won't be sticking out, so it'll be uh, good to go. Uh, we may have to extend down through here. Um, I might put something else right here later on to help the cows out. Um, probably some grain tanks, store some silage or something. Something, but I'm gonna make a, a small concrete road through here, and I might just square this thing out and put all concrete. I don't know. It's a future plan because we got a lot of grounds out here. And we ever get that field way back here, which is field 11, we will have uh, more grass. Okay, uh, let's get back to... Oh, Mr. Yankee's done. Why didn't you tell me, sir? All right, I don't have a, a truck down here. I'm going to go get a truck. All right, folks, let me uh, go get a truck down here and empty these things out because I don't want to take this too far because John from the dealership is going to come back and get it because I just re uh, leased it it's long enough to get these um, so yeah let me uh, get a truck and I will be right back folks alright folks I told you I would be back with a truck just got it parked and we have 219,828 liters of sugar beets. That's a lot just from that. Let's think how much it'd be with the whole field. Hmm. But anyway, let's uh see if we can figure out how to unload this thing. Okay, it's gonna be R. And there we go. Um, you know what? I forgot that truck only holds sixty thousand. <laughs> I might. Oh God! I might have to go get the big truck too. Wow.
Um, there is a lot of, let's see, get back down to my level here. Uh, where are we going to take these things to? Uh, sugar beets, sugar beets. We got great demand at Farmer's Choice for something. Um, uh, 885 there. What is our great demand for? Let's see, go over to. Let's see. Sorry, folks, my vision got bad there. Let's see, sugar beets. So just move over to there and then go back up to the fuel pump. Ah, right here. It's for whatever that is. Hmm. I have no idea. I have no idea what that is. Uh, I got a lot of stuff we can get into on this map. I just ain't enough time to do it. But anyway, price is going down and we're at the bakery. So, uh, I don't know. Jeep's mail is the highest, 885. Okay. For sawmill for wood chips. Wow. There's a slower time down since we're getting all these great demands. All right. Um, Jeep's Mills is over there, so straight on down to here and then go down. Okay. So. We're pretty much, whoa, no exit. Good way to flip a truck. So, folks, uh, I don't want to make this a drawed out episode of just selling sugar beets, so I'm going to probably sell this load because I'm trying to get the loan paid off. No, by the way, I need to show you all that. But let me get to where I'm going first. Let's see. I'll go down this road and make a left. And uh, be a Jeep smell. Whoa. Whoa. See, that's why you don't need to be. Whew. Don't need to be on your tablet while you're driving. There's our sawmill. We need to get a big truck over here. All right, there's our Jeep's meal. Ooh, it looks like a creepy meal. Um, wonder which side. No, I really don't know. We'll find out. Learn from your mistakes. Where that price is going up, I think this is the best place. Oh, seeds and fertilizers wanted. All right, we made $53,105 off of that. And I want to go ahead and show y'all real quick. Uh, we're going to go ahead and go over to. Uh, we have 270000 left on the loan. And this will get it down quite a bit. Quite a bit. Let's see here. We're going to go down to 1000 Okay. 155000 left on the loan. I'm going to go ahead and save this. And uh, folks, I think I'm going to end it right there. Uh, Yeah, I guess we can sell fertilizer and stuff here. And this looks like an area for straw. Once we get our straw build up, we can start bringing straw here and selling it. But uh, anyway, this is going to conclude the episode. 
uh, hopefully, well, I know for sure, next episode will be harvesting the barley and stuff. Uh, also, one other thing before I go, um, get the fertilizer up here. Uh, I had uh, one of the workers down here, I think it was uh, Jesse, had him down here. He fertilized 33. Uh, we got two stages done on 20, and that's as far as we can go. One we got paid for before we bought the field, and the other was after we bought the field. Uh, one stage on 33 is all we can do because it's, it's pretty much ready to harvest. Um, 32, uh, look like we might be able to get three. Oh, wait a minute. This is the last stage. So once we get done spraying here, it'll be ready to mow. I will come up and spray one, and then uh, everything will be legit set for six, and we'll, we'll spray it before we disc it, if I can remember. So I'm going to do some hauling the potatoes off screen, and let's see if that dropped that price. I'm, I'm pretty sure it did. Uh, Jeeps. Oh, yeah. Brought it down to 819, but we can go to bakery next. And then whichever one is the highest after that. Meal sales seven ninety two. Uh, I am gonna save some old for pigs. Uh, we have twenty thousand in there already, so that'll start us out on the pigs. I might put this a little more, and then uh, probably haul out another hundred thousand. I'll get a big truck. I'll add 100000 to the bakery, and then I'll be, be the rest. rest of it we'll put in storage. So, uh, folks, that's it. Um, I'm try to keep it as short as possible. Uh, probably about 15, 20 minutes already. Uh, I think I'm not for sure what I'm keeping up with the time. But y'all have a great day, a blessed day, folks. And we'll see you later, all right? Thank you. Love you. Appreciate everything. But I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.